Hey, what's up, viewers? Today we're gonna make uh, an octahedron. Basically, two pyramids fused together, and one of these. I don't know what these are called, but I just made it today. I just call it a spinner, whatever you want to call these. So to make this, we need 12, and this one takes 12 as well. Just so you can visualize this, we're gonna need two square sheets of paper, but we need them together. So in total that will create a um, a 4x8. So we need one of these, 4x8. Basically there's two squares in this. Two of these. Okay, so let's get started. We're going to make one module. We fold this in half. Then we fold both ends to the center then we open it so we're gonna use this point up here down here this line right here and this line right here I just drew these so you can see these these creases. We're going to fold this corner or this point up here to this line. But it has to go to this point up here. So you keep rotating until both of them match up. Okay. So now the same thing from the bottom, this bottom side right here. We're going to fold up from this point to this line. We're going to point this. Okay, the next fold is this fold to this center, to the center crease that we created. So it's going to fold to that center crease. This one comes down to this center crease. So we should have a shape like this. Okay, we flip over. This edge right here, let me show you. This edge up here is going to fold down to this line right here. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. Fold this down. To this edge. Then this corner is going to fold down to this line, down this way. We're going to do the same thing on the other side. Fold this down to this edge. And then the final step is to fold this down so that there's a nice point here. Same thing on the other side. Fold this down. Nice point here. So we're almost done. Make sure it's well creased. Okay. Now we're going to make a, uh, an equilateral triangle right here. We're going to fold this down or this over to this edge right here. And this one's going to fold down. to this edge right here. And then we fold this way. So we have something like this. These are going to be the pockets where these slide in with each other. So we're going to make 12 of these. Okay now, so let's put this together. So we grab one, this is going to be our triangle right here, and this slides into this one, okay? Then we grab another one, and this slides into this one, and this last one closes it up on this side. So 
So we have a triangle right here. Not a triangle, a pyramid. So now we're going to complete this one, this one, and this one. So again, grab this. This is the pocket, it slides in. Grab another one, this pocket slides in. And this one closes it up on this side. So that's two. We're going to make this side now. This one slides in. Slides into this one. And the last one closes it. Okay, so we completed these two. This Remember, this is our center. So we're going to make one more here. This slides in here. One more slides in here. And this closes it. Just like that. So this is the shape you want to make. Okay. Now, here's one triangle. And here's the other one. So these ones, this one, you're going to make three connections. This one's going to connect up here. Rotate it. This one's going to connect as well. And where'd it go? Oh, and this one's going to connect as well, right? Here. So we made a pyramid. And this is pointing out. So we're almost done here. So you can see the pyramid here. So you can see basically the pattern that we created. If you didn't get it, then just rewind, rewind the video and then watch it again. So now the top. We had a pocket. And we close this one in here. The same thing for these two. Oh no, this one slides in here. And this one closes it. And then the last one, one more. This one slides in here. Slides into this one. Then we have a mesh up here, we just slide them into each other. So there, we created this one. Okay, now we're going to make this one. This one's pretty simple. Let me open this. Okay, this is a pattern. So this is what you're gonna do. You need to. You're gonna slide one into the back pocket, close it completely, and then slide this one in. So instead, instead of making a point of three, you make uh, just two, one and two, and it creates a flap. And then you keep continuing the pattern. Until you have all 12. And then you close it at the end. You spring it around and you close it. And there you go.